Y'all, I have been sitting here since I got back home from dropping off my kid for the past hour. I've been sitting here for the past hour trying really fucking hard not to fall asleep because I have something that's coming in the mail and I have been obsessively watching the tracking and it just got delivered. Let's go get it. So nice outside. What the heck? Tra la 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 la. That's all I wanted. That shit can stay there. Not me skipping back home. I just saw a grasshopper sitting on top of the stop sign. And if it wasn't for me doxing uh, the street name that I live on, I would have showed you. But that shit was crazy. Try not to eat shit. Try not to eat shit. All right, we're going to open this together. We're going to have this moment together, okay? And I didn't want to show this to you until I had a link set up for you to get it. But I can't contain myself right now. I don't know how to make my phone stand up. My phone's got a fucking bracelet charm on it. Okay, it's fine. We'll be crooked. Okay, you guys do not understand. Is my fucking address on both sides? I like flipped it over and restarted the video because my fucking address was on one side. Anyways, you guys, I made this about a month ago. And it was just spur of the moment. I just made it. I got like super fucking inspired. And I was like, you know what? Let me just, let me just see how hard it is to make this fucking thing, right? Okay. And this is something I've been putting off making for a very long time because I've scared myself away from making it. Every fucking time that I, every fucking time that I was going to make something like this, I scared myself away from it. And I did it. Because I was like, you know what? It can't be that fucking hard. I'm just going to make this just for me. I'm not going to make this for anybody else. I'm going to make this just for me. And after I made it to completion, I didn't sleep that day. I sat up for six hours straight, nose to the grind, made this fucking thing, hit order, went to sleep. And I realized the next day I made a tarot deck. I made a tarot deck and I didn't want to show this to you guys. Until I had a link. I will get a link set up this week. Probably on my website. Probably on Etsy. Um, I'm not sure which one yet. Probably both. But anyways. I didn't want to show you until I had a link for you to do. And, and there will be a link. There will be a link for you to pre-order this. But I made a fucking tarot deck, you guys. I sat down for six fucking hours straight. And I did it. I made a tarot deck. And I... <sighs> she's here she's here i need okay so i just got the plastic wrapped one because i couldn't decide on a box i was like i can't it took me long enough to make the damn deck i can't even think about making a box right now i was like if anything i'll just find a fabric i really like and make all the goddamn bags myself okay i don't know i don't know what to do yet about that so it came shrink wrapped i'm gonna show you okay ready Okay, ready? You see the blue gilding? First of all, the blue gilding. I would love to say I was inspired by a Bella's tarot deck. It was not. I have a Bella's tarot deck and it does have blue gilding on it like this, but this is not why I use blue gilding on mine. Nothing felt right. I was thinking about how this would look with silver or gold or black. Anything else, there was a lot of choices on the site, and I could not go with anything else other than blue because of the backs of the tarot deck. Do you see it? It says Memento Mori, and some of you guys already know. Some of you guys already know what this is. This is the little astronaut from one of Mac Miller's albums, like an album. <laughs> Fuck. And I, of course, I had to do it so that it was reversible because, like... I had to do it the right way. But so you guys can already tell what this is. It's a Mac Miller tarot deck. It's a Mac. I made a Mac Miller tarot deck. I made a Mac Miller tarot deck. Hold on. Let me open it. You guys know that smell of a tarot deck fresh out of the box? The brand new, new book smell? I can't tell you how beautiful it is when it's your own tarot deck. Uh, I don't want to use it. I don't want to use it. Oh my God. I'm so happy. Okay. So I made it linen because because linen 
is superior. Um, I did make this a thinner cardstock first because I wasn't sure. Like, I do really like the idea of thicker cardstock, but we all know of a deck with too thick cardstock that you can't shuffle that just makes you fucking hate it. And I was like, let me take, let me take the hit. Okay, I put the money everywhere else. I put gilding on it, linen cardstock. I'll take the hit on thickness because I cannot have a deck where the cardstock is too thick for the sake of quality and then you just fucking hate it and you don't want to handle it because it's too thick and it hurts your fucking hands right we all know that we all know that <sighs> let me tell you every every card except for maybe four cards in the deck every card is mac miller every card is mac miller baby and i took my sweet time oh there she is hold on we're gonna we're gonna save that one there's another one she wants to come out yes i put ari in this deck but i did i was fair and i put mac's other girlfriends in the deck too but every fucking card is mac miller guys every fucking card is mac miller and i tried my very best to put thought into every single card and make sure that it still somewhat aligns with the meaning of each card except for the wands okay because i love mac miller so much and i love all of the smoking pictures of mac miller because not only am i a fucking pothead but also i've always loved images of people smoking i think they're so beautiful i don't know why i used to have a big picture of johnny depp smoking playing on the piano in my room when i was growing up i just love images of people smoking and so the whole wands suit is of mac smoking um little secret i used the numbers on the wands i tried to do it by like um either joints or cigarettes right but I ended up using number of fingers per card, <laughs> like number of fingers that are showing, like just as like a, a cheeky little nod to me because there's no way I can find a picture of him smoking 10 joints, right? But 10 blunts, imagine. But I had to find a cheeky way to put the numbers included in there. So every single one of these, I'm so happy. I'm so happy about this. And hold on, this is my favorite pairing in the whole deck. I'm so happy about this. There's one more in here that I really, really love so much. And I wish that my boyfriend, like, was into this stuff so that I could show him, like, how happy I am about this. But this one is fucking funny. I did this low-key for my boyfriend. And, again, he's never going to know. But this is, like, a little little nod to him being here at the same time because my boyfriend loves thundercat and my favorite performance of mac miller's is the npr tiny desk concert if you guys have seen it he vibes really well with thundercat it's so cute i love it so much so for the strength card when i was trying to find pictures of mac with a cat thundercat showed up <laughs> so i had to put thundercat in the deck thundercat's there ari's there max mom is there i put mama in there as the empress because who else are we gonna put as mac miller's empress archetype in here i'm sorry we had to put mama in and we had to put mama in the deck so again ari is in here a couple times i did use her a couple times because i love ari i do i'm sorry i know some of you guys are not big ari fans i love ari i had to put her in here a couple times she's only in here about four times i'd say um but again his other girlfriends are in here as well i did not i did not discriminate on girlfriends but this is probably my favorite card in the whole deck let me show you the death card i used self-care images uh, about three or four times in this deck because i love it so much and at the end i did state that this is just a tribute like from one fan to the next a little tribute for mac because we love mac look the filter put blush on him how cute and then i did also include this little card of like mac's writing um my soul remains here i love that because i i always feel like uh tarot decks based off of people um, especially past celebrities, past loved ones, whatever. I feel like it's like a horcrux. Oh, look at that gilding. Anyways, 
don't worry, next video will be a walkthrough. I promise. I know you guys want to see it. I'm so excited to show it to you. And I will get a link up this week so that you guys can pre-order these if you'd like. I'm so fucking...